hello friends welcome back to our techy 99 channel in this video i'm going to show you how to make a exit button friends if you don't know how to make a space shooter game on g develop software then watch my previous video first i request to you if you haven't subscribed our channel then please click on the red subscribe button and hit the bell icon to get my new videos notification so let's start the video click on add a new object is right and change its object name exit button and click on add an animation edit with p scale and now change its color this one okay Select this one tool and change its color. Okay, now click on save. Click on apply. Add a new object. A sprite and change object name button to click on save button and click on apply okay add a new object text and type here exit and here also exit and change its size it will be 50 and change its color white one and bold then click on apply add a new object text and type here ask and here type do you want to exit And change its size it will be 50 and change its color white one and bold click on apply add a new object text and change object name yes and here also yes and change its size 50 and color white one and bold click on apply add a new object text and it will be no its size will be 50 and color will be white one and bold click on apply now pull this exit button on the screen and pull this one also okay and pull this ask And here will be yes
now go to events add a new event add a condition and type here at the beginning of scene select this one click on ok add action button 2 will be hide add this one click on ok add action yes and hide this one also add action no and hide this one add action and ask text add this one also ok now click on add a new event add condition exit button and select this one the cursor and touch is on the object click on ok add action exit button and select this one tint color its color will be red one ok click on ok copy this one and paste it and right click and invert condition change this one this one ok click on ok add an event add a condition other conditions and select mouse and touch and select this one when mouse button will be pressed left click on ok and now select this one shift click and select all of this and copy this and paste here and change this one it will be so ok now click on add action and select exit button and it will be hide ok add action and select this one exit text and it will be hide click on ok now select this one copy this and paste it move this one here and change this one it will be button 2 and change here also button 2 right click and paste it and right click and invert this one condition ok click on add a new event add a condition other conditions mouse and touch when left button will be click when left button will be click on yes button then game will be quiet click on add action other actions and click on scene and quiet the game ok click on ok and move this one here go to new scene add a new object click on a sprite and it will be button 3 add an animation edit with p scale
y con apply. Okay, now go to events and copy this one and paste it. and click on add action button 3 and hide this one ok and click here add action and select this one button 3 and button 3 will be so ok and now copy this one and paste here ok hide button 3 just remember that button 2 is yes button and button 3 is no button ok if i will click on button 2 that means if i will click on yes button then game will be quiet ok if i will click on no button then nothing will be happen ok Now preview this one. If I will click on exit button, then they will ask you do you want to exit? If I will click on no button, then nothing will be happen. Okay. If I will click on yes button, then game will be quiet. Okay. Here you can see it game is closed. Okay. So I wish you like this video and subscribe our channel if you have any type of question then comment below friends if you haven't seen my previous video then click on i button and watch them i already made many videos on gdevelop software you can watch them okay so thanks for watching i'll see you in next video